Good morning. Good morning. What's your name? Foot. Foot? Yeah. How you get that nickname? Curb stomping. Huh? Curb stomping. What does curb stomping mean? Oh my goodness. Stomping the show. Stomping for show? Stomping a bitch out. Fuck you. Mean? Ooh, <laughs> so you just getting busy out here. Sometimes. Where What's you it? from? Here. Here? Yeah. Camden, New Jersey? Yeah. How old are you? 33. 33? How's your childhood like? Fine. It was popping? It was fine. Yeah. Describe it. Talk to talk. Um, it was good. I had a good childhood. I had a good home life. Okay. What brings you out here to Camden? Drugs. Drugs? Yeah. What's your drug of choice? Crack. Crack? What else? That's it. That's it? How long have you been on crack for? Ten years. Ten years? Mm -hmm. Have your life changed drastically afterwards? What do you mean? Like, you know how like before the drugs, how your life was? Did it change? Yeah, it went to shit. It went to shit? Right. You seen a lot, did a lot? Yeah. What's one of the craziest things you seen out here in Camden? Um, somebody holding in somebody's house, yeah. And then them taking the dead body, putting in a wheelchair, rolling it across the street, mm. and leaving them there, putting tires over top of it. That's deep, that's deep. Facts. That's deep. You got any clean time under your belt? I had five and a half years clean. Five and a half years clean? I did, yeah. That's strong. I feel like you could do it again. Right. You agree? Yeah. What you do uh, to get clean around that time? I left Camden. I just moved away. You left Camden, moved away? Yeah. So you kind of cool turkey or? Right. I can't oh, you cool turkey. turkey. Yeah. Oh, so you ain't do no clinic or anything? No. That's so deep. So picture you being in the clinic far away. You probably get clean again like this. Yeah. So, because my daughter's pregnant, so. Your daughter's pregnant? Yeah. How old is your daughter? 16. 16? Yeah. Wow. Did you have her around that age too? Yeah. So it's like a family no. cycle? No? no? No, it's not. That's how it is. Okay. What's your hobbies before the drugs? Cooking. I like okay. to cook. I'm really good at that. Baking. Okay. You go to Camden High School or? No. No? No. Okay. Charter? Washington Township High School. Oh, you went to school in Township? Okay. Okay. Mugga. Mugga went to Township too. Um. Huh? My boy Mugger. Mm -hmm. Yeah, so, um, You got any, like, growing up in your upbringing, do you have family members that was addicted to drugs? No. You didn't. You didn't at all? Mm -hmm. What's your sign? Sagittarius. Are you spiritual at all? Yeah. I... Yeah? How deep are you into that? My face is falling off. Huh? My face is falling off a bit. Okay. So this is where I'm at. Oh, okay. Shoot. Okay. Have you ever been arrested? Been any bids? Yeah, I've been arrested. Never did any, like, so, no, I did two weeks. You did two weeks in jail? You <laughs> got up out of there? Yeah, I'm not built for that life, sorry. Okay, <laughs> okay, all right, all right, all right. What's your highest level of education? Um, I got my associate's degree. You got your associate's degree? I did. Ooh, what's, your pl what's your plans? Like, your major and all that stuff, what you had in mind? I went to school for nursing. Huh? I went to school for nursing. Nursing? Yeah. You gotta get clean and get back to it. For them kids, for your little baby, for your grandkid. You know what I'm saying? These streets is hurtful. It's hurtful. These streets could bring you down. You know what I'm saying? You still got opportunity. You still young. You agree with me, right? Mm -hmm. You're still young. You got any friends out here that's living the same lifestyle as you in these streets? There are no friends. There's are no friends? Yes. Everybody for themselves? Yes. Okay, okay. How do you earn money for your addiction? Prostitution. Prostitution? Do it make you feel uncomfortable? A little bit, yeah. A lot of it. Do you get scared when you go in them cars and stuff? No, not really. I'm not really scared, you know? Why are you not scared? It's bitches pull balls. Big huh? facts. Bitches pull balls all day. Okay. Big facts. Okay. I've been through too much shit now, too. Okay. Yeah. That's what's up. You staying protected out here because it's real dangerous right. out here. For real, man. Um, do you do anything else to accumulate for your habit? Like boosting or anything? No. No, I don't fear any of that. You don't fear nothing? You don't get any of that? Okay. Mm -hmm. 
would you tell a 16, 17 year old that's just starting to rip and run these streets in the same shoes that you are in? What advice would you give them? Just go home. <laughs> I mean, I don't, I don't know what else to say. Just go the fuck home. Just like get the fuck out of here. Yeah, facts. And pray that the Lord saves you from yourself. Mm. Big facts. How do your family treat you out here? My family? Yeah. I've got a fantastic family. Huh? I've got a fantastic family. Okay. I did. I, did. I didn't have that hard knock life upbringing. None of that shit. I didn't have none of that. I just um fucked off. Is your family from Washington Township? Yeah. Okay, so you travel to Camden to do your thing, or? Yeah, here in Atlantic City, Atlanta, Georgia. Okay. How much money you think you make a day doing what you do on these street corners? Um, not in Camden. Yeah. Maybe about five hundred. Five hundred a day. If I'm lucky. Okay. If you said in Camden, do you reside other places as well? Well, Atlantic City, Atlantic City. Like, how much you make out in AC? Atlantic about fifteen hundred a day. Fifteen hundred a day in Atlantic City. Wow. What's the difference from Atlantic City and Camden? Uh, tourists. Casinos. Okay. Yeah. You know what I mean? Yeah. It's easier. So you got the one fifteen for the first 10 minutes to 200 for every half an hour. Right. You know what I mean? That's just how they charge up. But out here, all these bitches is dumb. You know what I mean? They'll suck, yeah. they'll suck dick for the hit of rock. You feel me? Wow. I, I mean, I don't. I won't. I refuse to. Right. But I have a bit of sound in my life. Yeah. Who introduced you to the drugs you use? John Thurling, this guy in Washington Township. Dude from Washington Township? Yeah. A friend of yours, boyfriend? He was my boyfriend. Okay. Washington Township is predominantly a white school, right? Mm-hmm. How was the drug use in that high school? Oh, it's absolutely horrible. It is. So a lot of people was on drugs. Everybody. Everybody was on drugs. Yeah. Suburban, right? Suburban? Yeah. Upper middle class white area. Upper middle class white area, wow. So you definitely had a good upbringing you just hung out with the wrong crowd. You dealt with the wrong crowd that led you in situations. Am I correct? Yeah. Where's that guy at now? Is he still using? He's dead. He killed himself. He killed himself? You know why? I'm tired of getting high. I'm tired of getting high and living the way he was living? Where do you see yourself in six months? Six months? Hopefully back on my shit, yeah. I okay. mean, I recently just relapsed. I recently just came back out here. You, you, got, you got clean for five and a half years. That means you can get clean again. Hell yeah. And all time media is rooting for you. Let's go get it. Let's get it. And you telling this story, telling this interview, you might save somebody's life today. I feel that. Yeah. All time media going to wrap it up. We thank you for your courage and you telling your story. God bless. We'll be praying for you, okay? Thank you. Thank you.